Morning, folks. Radio. Radio. Norman Radio. Uh, my name is Norman with Sack Spalding. I'm a radio broadcaster. The radio is afraid of me. The radio is gone. There ain't no radio left. No more radio. What they're calling radio now ain't. It's just telling us something that radio does a lot more. Yeah, radio has been pretty much um, removed from format. The format on radio right now doesn't have much broadcasting character to it. It's unfortunate. At one time when you listened to radio in the 30s and look at and listen to radio now, ain't no comparison. 1930s. There's no such thing as 20 this or 20 that. That's an incorrect remark from the calendar. The calendar never got to 20s. It stopped at 19, and once it went to 20s, it doesn't work at all. It didn't work at 19. It was 18, 17, 16. Look at that. You can see, whenever the calendar was used, they didn't know what the hell they were talking about. There's one of the problems with the calendar. It keeps you celebrating ceremonies that don't mean anything you say they are. The calendar is that someday will be considered a like a porn porn magazine. You know how you consider porn? Well, someday humans will consider that you watch porn all day long using the calendar because it misdirected everything accurate. You're not accurate using it. You're not accurate in anything you're doing. None of these systems leave you accurate. So accurate is why the electron moves. Without accurate, accurate the electron can't move. Then your light won't work. And your little invention won't work. Nothing works. This wouldn't work. All works because the electron and somebody accurate. To engineer something that works because accurate. Right now, you do not have accurate in most of your social structure of anything. Most of your terminology describing anything among yourselves is not very accurate. That's a big problem right now. Not enough capacitance and induction when you're not accurate. Not enough capacitance and inductance. The voltage goes to nothing and you have zero power. And you're running around looking like a goddamn puddle of green gook in a pond. Want a bath? And you want it greener. Shows you go the wrong direction, don't even know it. Ha! Ah, Jeremiah predicted this. Headed the wrong direction, too stupid to know. Here we are, whole planet. Jeremiah was correct. Yep. You don't have an election in Egypt, they didn't run against no. Everyone knows neither candidate's worth exam. And you don't have an election. It's not a free election. In fact, it's a trap stupidity. It's not an election. You have to vote for one or two candidates. It's stupid. You know neither one is worth a damn. That's not an election. You make them all run against the word no. And you, here's the main thing not preceding all elections and anywhere there is an election or ever has been an election. No conversation of what the meaning of anything is. They bring all this terminology and conversation around. It doesn't have anything to do with what the election is about. Wonder that? You've been doing that for quite a while on this planet. And you're living in anarchy over it, too. What about And using the word free, and in creation, there is no free. Good morning. Welcome aboard the Norman Woodstock Spalding broadcast. Like a ship, we sail this broadcast. Like a ship. I hope you enjoy it. We steer it from the rear. Good morning. <laughs>